Hey guys, I'm doing a weekly reading here. This is for June 13th to the 19th, Monday to Sunday. I usually lay out about two or three cards for each day. So here's Monday, Tuesday, and so on. And then I laid out one card in the middle at the end for the overall message of the whole week, which is the magician. The magician is kind of a, I can do it, I'm going to do it, exciting type of energy. Okay, so on Monday... With this justice and the Queen of Swords, doesn't it look like a very serious person here? Both the people and the cards there looks very serious. So, so justice is about balance and uh, the truth. So is the Queen of Swords. Truth, balance, words, the mind, ideas. Now look at Tuesday with the Seven of Swords, Queen of Cups, emotional person with the Nine of Swords. Sometimes the Nine of Swords is worry over nothing. You're worrying and worrying. You know how sometimes we worry about things that aren't really going to happen. Maybe you're worried about, you know, someone in that Seven of Swords is a sneaky person. Maybe you're worried that something is going to happen and it may not. Or someone has done something or maybe you've done something and you're worried about it. On Tuesday. Wednesday, the Three of Cups and the King of Cups came out. So Wednesday looks good in love. And uh, Thursday, Temperance with the Ace of Wands. Balance, a new idea. Thursday, you could have some sort of new spark, a new idea. Things are feeling more balanced on, on Thursday. And Friday, there's the Moon, Page of Pentacles, and the Hierophant. The Page of Pentacles sometimes is starting a new project or something you learn from. Uh, the Hierophant could simply be God and the heavens helping you with something. With the moon, you know, in this one, she looks a little crazy. She's, it's almost like someone took a picture while she's just shaking her head real fast. Sometimes the moon is like the lunar, you know, the lunar loon lunatic <laughs> maybe something about work or starting a new project or going to school is driving you crazy maybe you're feeling a little stressed a little depressed about it or something and and god is with you on that and here's friday the two of cups and the queen of wands that's you the queen of wands there's the lion down there so look at this, in this deck, the Two of Cups, she's got her head turned. She's standing there with her eyes closed, and he's coming up behind her. Sometimes when I use this deck and I get the Two of Cups, I always tell people there could be a lover or someone coming up right behind you when you least expect it. That's Saturday. This is Sunday. Uh, Sunday looks totally different. Sunday is just sadness and loss and... You know, the Seven of Wands sometimes standing up for what you deserve, or it could be a battle, but <clears throat> in this deck with the Five of Cups, I always think this looks like a one-night stand. He's running off, and she wants him to stay. So you could experience something slipping your grasp on Sunday. And this Four of Cups... It always reminds me of someone just talking amongst their friends what has happened. So Sunday looks a little stressful, but but the day before that with the Two of Cups, it looks it looks good. But I don't know, maybe this thing on Saturday, someone getting ready to come in, maybe you lose them the very next day. And Wednesday looked good for love, the Three of Cups. I don't always see the Three of Cups as a third-party situation. It just depends on the whole setup of the whole reading. Sometimes I might see it like that. It depends on the other cards around it. But to me, with the King of Cups, Three of Cups in this deck, it looks, it looks good. Uh, let's see. Your best day is probably Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Monday has that serious feel about it. With that Queen of Cups on Monday, you could be dealing with someone who is um, a little bit cold-hearted. But then again, the Queen of Swords may not be totally cold-hearted. It could just simply be an air sign. 
that you're dealing with on Monday. But that's your reading for June 13th to the 19th. I'll see you next time.